welcome back to That Can Make. Today I have the final trailer reaction for the day. And of course that reaction is Transformers Rise of the Beast official teaser trailer. And it's 2 minutes and 15 seconds. Um, I'm not the biggest, biggest Transformers fan, but I do like the franchise and I do like the characters. Uh, recently with uh, Bumblebee, which is a fantastic movie. Uh, the first Transformers movie. Um, the Michael Bay Transformers movie uh, just got uh, got had a short run in uh, theaters again, just for its anniversary. And I went to go see, and I saw it in the theaters, which was a really cool experience. Uh, so now we have Transformers: Rise of the Beast, which I'm assuming is uh, continuing on the timeline of Bumblebee, just rebooting the franchise, which I'm very glad of. We can just leave those Michael Bay movies behind, even though some of them are pretty solid. But the last night left a terrible taste in my mouth and that movie can go fuck itself but we're back we have rise of the beast very excited to see what this trailer brings to the table so we're going to get right into this we're start recording and three two one <laughs> For millions of years. <laughs> Transformed. Well. <laughs> nice. Optimus Primal. Stand down. I'm not the one to fear, Prime. There is a darkness coming. Let's go. Dude, they look so good. That's cool. Yep. Okay, Transformer. Oop. That's that's good. That looks really nice. <laughs> that looks like it's gonna be really good. Uh, I don't think it's Decepticons. I think I got that wrong. But yeah, Predacons. That makes sense. Okay. I'm sorry though. I'm not again. I'm not super familiar with the lore, but I do know about Beast Wars and I do know about uh, the Maximals. And I do know about those characters. So. uh... I'm very, very interested. The movie looks great. Uh, definitely does need a little more polishing, a little bit, but it looks, it looks really good from uh, what I see. I do, I, I don't really fuck with um, Optimus's design. His design in uh, Bumblebee was way better. This design's all right. It just feels, it just, it makes him look scrawny, dude. It makes him look like too skinny. The one in uh, Bumblebee made him look like more of it, uh, more like his, uh, version in the car and the cartoon, uh, in the original cartoon movie, so, you know, I'll do, it's fine, but I'm very excited to see, uh, what this movie does, because it sounds great. Also, that line goes hard. I've been seeing, I've actually been seeing that, uh, that shot of Optimus, uh, at the end there before he says, let them come, uh, <laughs> Before he says that, I've been seeing the shot everywhere with that tagline. 
And I, I didn't hear it though, luckily, I didn't spoil myself on that, but I did... But hearing it here in the trailer was cool as shit, so I'm definitely excited to see uh, where this movie goes. And uh, excited that this franchise is finally getting rebooted, which it definitely deserves it, and especially bringing uh, the Maximals and the Predacons into this universe. Universe? I meant live action. Don't know why he said that. But, um, yeah, uh, that's all I gotta say about this trailer. It looks really good. Um, so that's the end of this video. Uh, if you guys can please like, share, and subscribe. That's the last of the trailer we actually today. But I do have a video going right up, which is my review for Violent Night. So if you want to check that out, that's going to be probably up here or down the link below. So, um, yeah, thanks. thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out.